What's going on guys, it is me Flawless back with another video and in today's video you guys, I want to show you guys a fix in the Epic Games Launcher because about two days ago I had this problem where I tried to download Grand Theft Auto 5 and it got stuck on the verifying screen. So for example, say I was going to download something in the Epic Games Launcher like Borderlands, just say like verifying and then eventually it would get stuck on 93% and it wouldn't continue downloading. So unfortunately, um, I did find out that you have to reinstall in order to fix this problem. So whatever game it is stuck on, so say I'm downloading Fortnite and it's verifying and then it gets stuck on 92%, you have to reinstall. So what I did that caused, I guess, this problem is I downloaded it onto my uh, new like external drive. So I downloaded it on this drive right here, uh, which is the, my D drive but you have to download it on your C drive in order to fix that problem. So whatever drive you installed it on before is probably causing your problem. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix it. So say I downloaded Grand Theft Auto 5 and it got stuck on the screen, like on the Firefang screen. Click right here, you gotta click on uninstall. Um, I'm gonna do it for Borderlands because I don't wanna uninstall it right now. But just imagine this is Grand Theft Auto 5, it got stuck on the Firefang screen. Just go here, make sure to click on uninstall and then once you like install it again click on it click on accept and right here you want to choose installation location so click on browse and make sure to click on your c drive and that should fix your problem and click on select folder and then once the game is done downloading and it's going to start verifying again you should have no problems at all that's what fixed my problem i know it's kind of annoying that you have to reinstall it it's most likely because you downloaded it on a different hard drive if not then i'm sorry but you're probably gonna have to reinstall it anyway that's the only fix I found. I tried looking on YouTube and nothing worked except that. So I hope it works for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.